Hello everyone. Thank you for joining me for another episode of our video newsletter. And I appreciate all of your comments and your emails back to me. And I appreciate it. And I appreciate your support. Today, I wanted to talk about something seemingly, again, very simple, but we do it all the time. And oftentimes, I see students make mistakes. It is how do we come down from second position? We do a lingerie. How do we come down to a preparation position? And we finish with the chin up and done. Every combination, almost on the bar, every combination, we do this. After a combination finish, we do a lingerie and arm down and head comes up. Let me break down to a frame at a time and then point out some of the mistakes I've seen from the students. One of the major mistakes is this, not pay attention to this arm, head stayed in front. That's the number one mistake because all what we do here is total body integration. This is one of the major contribution of Vaganova system is total body integration, head, shoulder, eyes, hand, elbow, everything into one cohesive movement to deliver a qualitative approach. So one mistake we cannot happen is this. This head cannot stay still while the arm does it itself. Second mistake, if this arm too high. When you do elange, the arm should at the highest at your shoulder level for a brief second. Then it's time to come down. When you do elange, this arm should never pass your shoulder height. Number three, look at my fingers. It is not this way, like a butterfly. Elange. Fingers reaching out, then come down. The fourth thing we have to think about is a very subtle movement, the connection of your elbow. Look at my elbow. My elbow is going to come up. Then there's a critical moment when the fingers reaching out, the, the elbow has point down. This movement has to be complete before the arm can descend. I do that again. Look at my elbow, it's toward back. Little circle, the elbow has to finish pointing down to the ground before the descent, the arm can happen. So I lead by my elbow and I'm not leading my wrist. That's another mistake I see all the time. The fifth mistake, actually it's one of pretty uh, major one for me. Look where my elbow stopped. My elbow stopped right around demi elange. You see, demi elange. Preparation, elange, demi elange. Comes down to right around where the demi elange is. At this moment, the elbow, no more movement. The hand comes in. Perfect preparation position right outside of our thigh. This is a major mistake that please do not let your students to do this, which is go too far down and to do one of these. Once again, the correct way is right around demi elange. It's time to finish by arm, hand come in directly to outside above your thigh instead of go in and out. So once again, elbow down, head follow the hand, and head continue follow the hand, head comes up in a profile. It takes practice. Once it's in the student's body, they will be doing this as long as they do ballet. However, if they don't have clear instruction, they will be making, I just list about five to six mistakes. For one single thing, it can be five, six mistakes. And this is at the end of the combination. 
it is very important for us to conclude the combination in the correct classical way, simple way. So I hope this is uh, helpful to you. And uh, once again, thank you. And please try those ideas with your students. And, uh, and let me know if, uh, if it helps or not. And if you see the difference, I, I hope it does. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.